Now, they say it is better to learn on the job, and that's certainly what a group of Nottingham photography students are putting into practice. They are. They've set up a photography agency, thought to be the first of its kind outside London, and they've already landed a number of shoots, as I've been finding out. You've just turned your head this way a little bit. practice shoot with a fellow photography student, but it's rapidly becoming a thing of the past. This group from Central College Nottingham have set up an agency, which is thought to be the only one outside of London. So far, they've captured shots for a variety of professional clients. So we've had some studio shoots, such as like family portraits. We've just worked with a salon to do like heads and shoulders shots for hair and beauty. Um, we've done sports events. With there being 20 of us, we've got enough of us to cover all different genres. Now, the students do get paid, but the money doesn't go into their own pockets. Instead, it's put into a fund which is used for things like buying new equipment, going on photography trips and putting on more exhibitions. Everyone now can take a photograph and a lot of people call themselves photographers because they have a Facebook page. This is really, this goes deeper than that, this goes to about the, the, the whole professional nature of what you need to know as a, a, a photographer. Taking a photograph is probably only 30-40% of actually being a photographer. Well, I was soon made a potential client. Do you feel pressure because it's not just your friends, these are mm. clients essentially? Oh, well, it's a lot different. <laughs> So nerve-wracking at times, but it makes you work harder because you don't want to mess it up because it's just for them. Tonight is the agency's official launch, and cameraman Mark and me certainly give it the thumbs up. Actually, Mark doesn't know that he's he's been caught on camera, it's but like a there you shot. go. Yes, thank you very much for that.